Questions like this capture the soul of poverty across Africa. It is unbearable to think that people have to live this way every day, but a few others can afford better standards. At the 2018 and next Einstein Forum, women are poised to break down barriers in the world of tech, from science, technology, engineering, and new program to encourage uh, girls, not only girls, but mostly women that are doing their PhD, their postdoctoral, to actually come work in our lab as an assignment. Experts project worse conditions for half of the 400 million people living in extreme poverty. You may not have been confined in a prison, but if your thoughts do not align with possibilities, then maybe you have. Have you ever felt in One of the biggest stories that the capital has witnessed this week and the debate on the demolition of one of the biggest slums in Ghana, Sodom and Gomorrah, has begun. ...and talk about issues. At the end of the day, you don't necessarily find a major improvement in the issues that were tabled for discussion. How different will this meeting or talk be? What should we expect at the end of the meeting? So what do you want the youth in particular to take away from a freedom that comes from within? Well, um, Martin Luther King used to say that life's most distant and urgent question is, what are we doing to help others? From Lagos, Nigeria, is Femi Abufala, Head of Manufacturing Policy Commission at the Nigerian Economic Summit Group, and he joins me via Skype. Hello Femi, thank you for agreeing to speak with us. Oh, you are very welcome. Thank you so much, too, for this opportunity. The report said in most sub-Saharan African countries, there's potential to grow the tax base. So if we can all join hands, a shake-up in the timber export industry in Gabon. The Gabonese government has imposed a definite ban on three highly prized wood species. The announcement comes a decade after the ban unlocks in the Central African nation. Now the news has been welcomed by... And that's it for Business Africa. This week, you can be a part of the program via our various social media platforms. Follow me on Twitter at Ignatius and also head over to africanews.com for the entire program and more.